Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Before we get started, make a comment down below, give me a big thumbs up, subscribe, turn on notifications. Sorry, sorry, I haven't been uploading, I've been so busy, but yeah, having my children. One is a two month old, still only one guy, he was born early, so still tiny, doesn't even fit in up to one month. So we got him a new pram, we went from the Benin to the Silver Cross Pioneer. There is the Silver Cross Wafer or something, and then Pioneer. The only difference between the two prams are the wheels. Pioneer has bigger wheels, I like more. So yeah, so we're gonna do a review. So I paid I think in between fifty or eighty fifty quid for this. No, thirty quid off marketplace. I've got it Saturday, no Friday, bargain. Carry cart never been in touch, car seat she said fairly been used, toddler seat, nothing wrong with it, nothing. The only thing is the hold on this pram has faded, it's just gone to brown. Doesn't bother me at all. So yeah, here it is. It has four different height decisions with the handles. You probably like, why is it on the lowest? You're too big for the lowest. I am five foot six or five foot seven. I can push it on the lowest position. It's not the best, like, not something someone would push it on, but I love it on the bottom. Like, I love having my hands like right down, or I can use it on the second. So this is the first position. Then if you just pull this button here, it's push button. This is second. This is third. This is fourth. So fourth is the biggest. It's dead high, as you can see. I can't push that. Um, I use the lowest, so yeah. It has a massive, large shopping bag, which is kind of just like see. Um, it has two front 360 wheels and what two at the back, and they are rubber. Um, and the shopping bag, you can hold. It can hold your raincoat, diaper bag, and a bag. Or if you've got nothing in there, and two bags. And yes, finally my biceps are on your team. Um, I will fin. I can't believe I all year eleven class. My school's finished now. I will finish a year this time next year. So yeah. So like I said, the basket's big. It does have like a flat thing here. This chat uh, tells you it holds up for about three years. So yeah. So how to fold this thing? So you have these hoops here. These. You have them on both sides. But on this side, you have like a lock thing you can kind of see here. Push that, pull them both up, and it collapses. It doesn't fold the big, it folds quite big. So if you have a small car, then don't recommend because we have two cars, two prams in the car. We have the Kazak Giggles for my 15, no, my well, 12 months, I think she is, 15 months. She doesn't, um, and then you um, use it by that, the bottom one. Um, yeah, 30 quid it deal, it had included everything, you name it, everything. Um, so yeah. So the third thing is the rain cover. It came she gave me this little bag. It, when you buy this brand new, it will come with the bag anyway, it says silk cross. So the rain cover is kind of like a normal clay where the bit is, and then where the hood is, it's black where the hood is. Don't know how you can keep it dry, but yeah, something I keep underneath. Next thing you'll get when you get this crown are the Silver Cross car seat adapters, these, these. Or if you're using the Mexico one, then you can buy the Mexico one. So the extra things that I use for this pram is a carabiner hook. You can get these from Home Bargains. I paid $1.99 for this one. It's just a small one or two, whatever you want them for, really. I love this newbie. Like, it's like a dummy holder, but you can hold anything in it. 79p, I just hold a pad, um, hand sanitizer, and a face mask um, this is his pram toy for his pram, uh, carry cart it's not going to actually use it but it's two pound per pound and i actually love the pattern of it look it's got like a little squeaky thing a little croc a little frog and then like a little teaver and i love it next thing is this one i think i paid about 10 or 14 quid for this it was worth it i actually love it there's so much things you can do with it play with it like he won't play with toys yet, anyway so yeah, then we're going to move on to, um, and this is the diaper bag I use, it's just a plain black one, it's from Boots, it doesn't matter what, which one you can use, and diaper bag can go either in the basket or on top, so it doesn't bother. So, we'll start off with the car seat, the car seat did come with um, shoulder pads, but they're like they thick, like they need to take, like they're too thick, I am switching them to black mud care ones soon, just not now, so this is the hood. Not a best hood, says Silver Cross, because it doesn't really cover you properly. 
Yeah, it hasn't. Um, it came like this nice hot muffin. It does have like a little insert inside. That I think stupid. Like, see that head, that bit there. I think it's stupid because your child won't last long in this because that doesn't come off. It does come off and it leaves a pat the thing at the back, so not the best. This will last up to, should last up to about 9 to 12 months. And then to take this bit off, you can't see. This video should be about 15 and um, to take this off, I'm still having, um, you just have this bit here that's on this. And to put it in the base, we'll just click it in. We don't have a base because we don't need it. But yeah, just like that, it's thick. And inside, I'm talking about this. This bit can't come off. Like, it can come off, but like, it's leaving a hard bit at the back. And then it has like this very cute like, thing here that's thick. Um, I'll have. Um, yeah. Um. So yeah, and just ask Charles the pads enough, they don't really are. So when you first have a baby, you have the cut, the carry cut. This is what it looks like. So let's click it on, you just want to level them with the cast seat, it's cut the frame itself. Until you hear a click. So, features is the hood. Nice hood. The hood goes from carry cot to toddler seat. It has a tiny bit here that you can push in. I don't know what these hooks are for. And then at the back, it has a peekaboo window. Then, um, tip the hood down. Yeah, it has this really nice bit of hair that I'll show you. It, it ha just has two magnets that go over the bar. I love this silk crossbar because it's a 360 turn bar. Like, no, not many are going to find, but this is it. It says so across here, don't know if it's going to pick up, probably not, no it doesn't. So to take this off, where your bar, bar goes, you just push down, whether you clip it in like I'll show you now. Um, and this goes from carry cot to toddler seat, this does, you just throw it onto the toddler seat, uh, the carry cot. Look how nice it is. And these are the clips I'm talking about. Inside it comes with a nice rakey thing and this carry cot is suitable for overnight sleeping. So you can buy it in most plastic sheet anything, that's what we did. But it has this really, really nice like soft material. That's why most people suitable for overnight sleeping, like it's so soft. And so it's the whole pram right round, it's the same material. Um it's best, it's comfort, my baby loves it. Um even though he does he does fear to sleep in the cassette I want. My daughter's old one, but yeah, nothing more to say about the carry cot and to get them off. You, where it says silver cross at the top, you just like tuck them out. And it's off. And then to take the um hood off, you just pull these on both sides. Um, unwrap them. And then done. Now I'm gonna do the hood off. Toddler seat is suitable from about six months, but take like five months. Um, and your child will be facing your claws, it can face in and out. Um, clicking it in. Um, this is the lowest it goes down. This is second, and this is third. So, with this, it has two height positions that are in here, so you can have the hood on the lowest and then the highest when they're a bit older. It's not going to focus on here. Yeah, these bits, so the bottom one we're going to have it on. So, you want to take your hood, so you're going to want to put this whole bit through where the push button is at the back. Then you want to put the hood on. Push it from the front, it goes on a bit easier, and then drive through it. I don't know if it does, oh no, it doesn't get there either. And again, this is how the toggle seat looks. It does have a nice harness, it is not the best, but yeah. Um, it, I think it comes with a pram line or you have to buy it, I don't know. We're just using Michelle's Cassetto one. And this navy, navy blue. Um, just to make it a bit more cosy. Michelle doesn't use the pram liners anymore anyway, or even the coast toes. We won't be using the coast toes as it has one. Um, it has 
like I said, exactly the same one as the Cali Cop, but you have to you have to sit this bit on it. Um, so you just slip it on. Very very easy. You just sip it on using the sip, and then you just velcro it at the sides. And if anyone in year eleven is watching this as Anne had left, um, I hope you had the last few days of your life. I can't believe I'm leaving now, but I'm scared to leave because I don't want to leave because I don't want to end up in jail. I want to end up in jail, I just need to keep my swearing down. Um, so yeah, very quick that up, then pop it down. So it should look a bit like this. Then you don't want to put this under. But, um, grab your hooks and hook it to where the crown bar would go underneath. And before I even do anything, I am going to rate this pram a 10 out of 10. I love it, and this will be something I have. If I ever had another child, make sure you work with this bit on the bottom. Then you can put your pram bar on. Make sure you put your pram ball the right way, it doesn't matter which way it goes, it just has to stay across. And then here the clip and then one it and then that's what it looks like. So this is what it looks like on one position. Uh, so this is what it looks like on one with the top thing. Second and third. And then how to take it off again, pull these and then you can face it out. That I'll probably do because some people might be interested in that. So the clip. So this is what it looks like on the fourth, outwards, second and third and second and outwards. Then we're going to look at the last feature of this pram, it is my carrot top car seat. So you want the car seat doctors, make sure they, they are on the right way. I tend to forget what which way these go on because I've never had anything like these before. Break that bottom, grab the car seat and hold in the car seat. And I can't this bit, oh, can't get to it yet. Put it on. Um, and there you go. I love the car seat. My head, like, look at me and my children and everyone. And then this is the best thing I like about a sofa. Is it just this? This is better for in the car for your baby. It has like so many different positions. Um, and then, and then you roll on diaper bag. I was going to say it adds on your foot mask, no, just a bit, for a cold day. But my newborn loves it, so he always has it on. No, he's not a newborn, but I still cast him as a newborn. And there you go. Off you go with your newborn. Hope you enjoyed this problem video, and I'll hopefully do another one next week. Always knew this day would come. And before anyone gets at me saying, are you pregnant? No, I'm not, even though it does look like I am, but I'm not. Don't think I am, anyway. No, because I'm a period day, so no. Bye.